Hello friends, in this video we will make the complex tris acetyl acetonato cobalt 3. You will need 2.5 grams of cobalt carbonate, 10 milliliters of acetyl acetone and 30 milliliters of 30% hydrogen peroxide solution for this experiment. A 100 milliliter Erlenmeyer flask was taken and into that was added 2.5 grams of cobalt carbonate. Then 10 milliliters of acetyl acetone was added. The mixture was shaken well and it was placed in a setup like this. A pressure equalizing funnel was connected on top of the flask and the flask was placed in a water bath which was heated to 90 degrees Celsius with stirring. 30 milliliters of hydrogen peroxide solution was added to the pressure equalizing funnel. With simultaneous heating and stirring, hydrogen peroxide was allowed to fall into the mixture. You immediately see the color turning dark green and a glistening black colored precipitate is formed. And this is the product cobalt acetyl acetonate. The overall reaction is given here. Hydrogen peroxide will convert the cobalt 2 plus ions to cobalt 3 plus and this will form the complex with acetyl acetone. In this closer shot, you can clearly see the dark green crystals formed. After the addition of hydrogen peroxide, the solution was heated for another 15 minutes. Then we take it out and then allow to cool to room temperature. Then the flask was placed in an ice bath for about 3 to 4 hours. After about 4 hours, the solution was taken for filtration. I am using a vacuum filtration method using a Buchner funnel. You can also use a simple gravity filtration method here. After filtration, we wash the precipitate 2 or 3 times with cold distilled water and then let the vacuum run so that the compound will be dry. Then the crude product was taken for recrystallization. The recrystallization is carried out using 96% ethyl alcohol. Here I am dissolving the compound in ethanol and then we will let it cool down and evaporate. And these are the crystals of the product. And this is the final yield of tris acetyl acetonato cobalt 3. That's all in this video. These are my Patreon supporters who are financially aiding me so that I am able to purchase new equipments and chemicals for my videos. You can also support me via Patreon or PayPal. The links of both of them are given in the description. Do subscribe to the channel and click on the bell button for notifications if you are new to the channel. Thank you.